All right, guys, I hope you guys are enjoying some of the content I'm putting up on the YouTube channel. So this is what we have right now um, in terms of just moving in, getting all the boxes um, from my, sorry for the dirty laundry, um, from my house to here. I obviously wasn't at home to actually pack this stuff, so they did do a lot of moving in. Check out that War Greymon back on uh, my wallpaper. Grab that off Reddit, it's so awesome. So, um, stuff like this, like my, my Vivix, is just like, eh. I mean, I don't know if it's going to be worth something one day, so, um, a lot of mint on cards. Uh, this box right here, actually, is a lot of my, um, childhood stuff that I grew up with, so, I don't know how well you guys can see that, and I got my comics, the original comics from here, oh crap, this is really bent, fuck, sorry for the language, but, like, a lot of the stuff, um, this one was actually cracked, down here, I apologize for my feet. Um, this is just like really out of the blue. Um, I bought this book on eBay. I think I have a video on this. I don't know. But um, I grew up with this book too. I remember that specifically. So a lot of this stuff like this. I got this Blue Ranger really like last second um, for my figure arts. The rest of my stuff like my mecha and my figure arts are downstairs. So um, here's all the Megazords that I really wanted to keep. Um, because I might start selling some stuff. Uh, mainly like Menton card stuff. I don't know yet. Um, I'm really trying to save up for, like, uh, camera equipment and stuff like that, so, um, there's that, uh, I honestly thought these were lost, I don't, re I didn't remember putting them into here, this box specifically, I thought I put them in here, um, I don't know why, but, uh, I, I mean, I found them, like, I was like, I pull up all the stuff because my dad, um, my, my parents put just, like, random stuff on top of it, so, uh, there's an automorphin training in here. Um, so yeah, this used to be my old room. I figured that like the way the the whole thing was set up, I was really wasn't digging it too much. So see, as you can see, I'm gonna be moving these uh, later. Um, my red and black one. We went to the store that um, the little uh, shop that they had them in uh, Frankincense, and they have a different texture now, different finish. It's a matte finish, which I actually really liked. So I don't know. Uh, some of my sneakers that I still have to put together. Um, so this is all right here. That's an Olga. Um, I'm gonna put all these mint on cards into a box. Stuff like this, I really want to display. Um, mainly these two. These will be shadow boxed. Um, Saba won't be. Well, I have a loose Saba anyway. So um, more first, definitely. Oh, there it is. Okay, cool. I was wondering where this one was. Um, some Power Rangers watches. Out. I'm gonna put in there. And I'm not too sure about what I'll do with the Legacy line, considering that I'm not, like, really collecting the White Tigers Ord or the Saba until it really goes on sale. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot I have these too. Um, those figures will probably, and they might be on sale. The Morphers would definitely be on sale. Um, so, I don't know yet. Uh, that's a Legacy uh, Ultra Zord. I still have this. Oh crap, I gotta put that back. A lot of pop vinyls. I got more pop vinyls over there. Uh, my Attack on Titan ones. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm trying to um, put everything together um, because I don't like I don't have shelving units or anything like that. They completely just left a bit <laughs> in Jersey. So I'm kind of SOL right now with a lot of furniture. I really just have a bed, a desk, and a nightstand. So and I don't have a lot of hangers. And I have a lot of clothes. Um, so I have to go through that and uh, pretty much uh, sort what I'm going to give to the Philippines or to the homeless people or to Goodwill, whatever. And uh, yeah, I got to do that. So this is what I'm going to be doing right now. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I'm gonna th probably going to keep that 2010 Megazord, probably. So I'm going to do that right now. Be right back. All right, guys. So um, one of the... Uh, I'm a little upset right now. Um, before I moved, um, a lot of the stuff was already packed and just like put together. Um, so this was pretty much full. Um, but my parents decided to take it upon themselves because I have so much shit. So they literally just said that to me. There's so much shit. Um, so this happened a lot. Um, a lot of the Super Legends, which I was planning to keep, especially mint on card or something like that, really are bent like, fantastically. Um, so this really sucks. Um, but everything's short packaged, really. Fudge. God dang it. Like, yeah, this really sucks. Uh, like the the hooks got really got really screwed up. Oh my gosh, that's fine. I don't give a crap about Robo Knight. The uh, which one? Where is that one? This one got bent. So that really sucks. I have John Mayer playing in the background just to calm me down. Um, of course, like the empty one. Like I just like kept this. The Super Legends Green Power Ranger. It's fine. 
But everything else like I really did care about really got screwed up. Uh, in terms of, okay, so which one is this one? Okay, at least Green Ranger. Green Ranger is apparently like one of the most expensive ones. Alright, Armored. Okay, so I think I'm going to be selling a lot of the like metallic horse figures. This one. Um, at, at a start, so I see how I feel about selling stuff because I'm really, I'm kind of attached to every single piece of these. Like, especially Super Legends, the MMPR 2010s. Um, Jungle Fury, that's when I really got back into it, so it's really going to be difficult for me to, to go back and try to sell them, so I don't know. Um, I have this metal card. I have a lot of metal card stuff. Holy crap, I forgot I have this. Retro Fire, original Retro Fires. Look at that, guys. I think it's in beautiful condition, just like, I'd rate that an 8. Not bad. Good job on me. I really like this. I like the style packaging they put these in instead of, um, the half cylinder. There's that one. Where's the cylinder? Just like run around. There you go. And the cylinder one during Samurai. Stuff like that. So, definitely better than those ones, the Ghost of Great ones. So, yeah, I'm gonna keep going through here, checking along. I have to empty all this first and then actually empty all these ones first. That's where I'm gonna put the mint on cards because I feel like that's more protective than this. And most likely the MMPR stuff will be on display because these ones will just be like sitting there just collecting dust because I'm planning to sell them probably like 20 to 30 years. So that's my plan right now. So I'm going to get to that. I'll see you All guys. Right, so this is um, at least 80, 85, I want to say 85% of momentum cards. Um, like I said, I'll probably be selling the uh, super, the uh, metallic force figures, the, the mega force ones. Um, speaking of the metallic force, anyone remember this? This was a Disney store exclusive. I don't know if anyone remembers this. Um, but they had this one. I forget who else was in this series. I think it was Ninja Storm was also one of them. I forget the other Red Ranger that was in here. Um, but there was about three of them. And it came during the Jungle Fury line, as you can see. And it came with these like really weird um, uh, weapons. And they still, I'm surprised they still have the mold. And it's actually probably one of the best uh, figures I've, I've had. And I kept on to this one. And I never really wanted to sell it. The other one I had... I think it was the Ninja Storm one. It sold for $30. Like, the guy was like, I really want this one. And surprisingly enough, I bought this for 5 bucks at the Disney store. These were on sale at the time, as you can see. This is legit, guys. Um, Bandai Operations. So, yeah, you can kind of see it. So, if it wants to focus. Um, but any whoosies. Um, like I said before, with these, um, my Super Legends are bent. What I'm doing right now um, is... I am putting under my MacBook Pro. Hopefully, it'll you know gain its uh, original form there, and uh, we can have those in really good condition. Because I'm never gonna sell those ones. These, in my opinion, were probably one of the best figures um, that I've ever bought. The Super Legends Green Ranger was definitely one of like the most beautiful figures, and um, it was at a time where I was getting back into Power Rangers, so this was perfect for me. And I spent oh my god, I found three of these ones. And, uh, what was it? I opened two, I opened one, I kept this one, and I sold another one. I found Lord Zed everywhere, I found at least, like, five of him. Um, I've only found, like, two sets of these, the White Ranger and the, I think the Gold Ranger's underneath. Um, and surprisingly, this is the only one. I'm still looking for that, uh, Titanium and the other, uh, Ninja Storm Samurai Green Ranger, not the, uh, the Super Samurai one, so... Um, if anyone has any leads to those that has them relatively cheap, because these things are expensive, let me know. Um, as for these ones, like the Dino Charge Megazord, I don't know if I'm going to keep this in package, actually. I kind of want to open this. I already have my Gundam out. Um, there you go, there's my Gundam. In addition, <laughs> in addition to that, um, I have, I bought a Son Goku um, at uh, Frankenstein's for 15 bucks. Can't beat that. That was really cheap. I was just like, dude, I want that. That's gonna be my new, like my new desk toy. Also bought this sweet Sentai um, book. It's for six bucks. It has everything from the beginning essentially to uh, Ninja Storm. So is it Ninja Storm? Because I think they like. Hey, what did they do? I'm trying to avoid copyright. Oh yeah, it's Abra Ranger. They like sneak preview Abra Ranger. Um, also, what should I do with these? Is it, you guys think it's worth keeping like open? Open plastic stuff like Rita. I think this one's probably, I don't know. I might throw that because it's a dirty bent. <laughs> There's no point. Um, but these ones, what do you guys think I should do? Do you think it's worth keeping them or or what? Because honestly, they're just taking up space right now that probably really do need at this moment. So leave a comment down below. 
And I'll be back with more Power Rangers stuff, believe me, in like 10 seconds. Alrighty guys, welcome back. Um, I guess this is part two, I'm not sure how I'm going to do this, but... Um, today, uh, Will is coming over in just a bit. It is currently, I can't even, 4.16. That's what my watch says. So, Will had to do something real quick. Don't blame him, I don't really, yeah. I, I cleaned my room, so it's not that bad. I actually just really just, just stacked all these, uh, um, all these up. This is a sign from Mr. Temple Asia that my friends did for supporting me. Um, I find out some of the, uh, the figures here. Not too bad. Except the Ninja Storm one, I really don't really care. I uh, found some of the pop vinyls. I think the other one is in my Sentai box. I saw and found that. Um, my mom packed my uh, my Power Rangers in Space shirt that I had back then. Uh, this is what, a large? I have no idea. I was a big kid back then. Um, this is a medium. So, how old was I? Was that 1999? 98? Is this 98? I don't even remember. Doesn't say, but uh, yeah, I was a medium. I don't know if that's normal, but whatever. Um, so yeah, I put the pop vinyls, set up my gun amount. If I showed you guys that, if I did that, this one I don't care about really. Um, what's there? I'm gonna put these up all over my desk, but I'm gonna get a new desk in the in the near future because I want a corner desk and I'll be running two computers, one for like regular, you know just socializing or whatever, get tasks done, word processor, another for my editing suite, so that'd be nice. Um, also transferred over um, this case that was supposed to be downstairs, but we really didn't have any room. Um, and I got Titanus up here. Uh, let me just say that this Titanus is awful. Um, I would not suggest putting it into uh, Ultra Zord. The Titanus itself isn't that bad, but the Ultra Zord more mode is awful. Um, it took me like at least 20 minutes to set this thing up without falling down. And you can see there's already a slight lean to it, and I did put the uh, little thing in there, and it's already, you can see there's a little gap in between. It's shooting the gap, so, no, nah, right there, okay. So, yeah, uh, my back hurts from that because I had to like hunch over and stuff like that. I got some of my figure arts in here. I still need the yellow ranger and the armored black ranger. And then I'll set everything up. Did put the original Power Morphers in there, because you know I had to. Um, I have the Legacy Power Morphers in there. And I still got tons and tons of more stuff to go through. Because um, I want to put the original Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. I actually want to set up like a huge, just shelves. Like, shelves galore um, in here. So, uh, I have a lot of space, as you can see. Um, just this one's for editing and stuff like that. This one will be for the television. I'm going to set that up next week, I think. Um, this one, I don't know what I'm going to do with this. Um, there's a lot of potential in there. I still need drawers. I put up a lot of my shirts in there. I still have more. I ran out of hangers. Um, and I have sneakers. So, I guess that'll probably be for sneakers, or this side will be probably for sneakers. And Yeah, so... Oh, I still have to clean this up. All right, so I gotta go clean up a little bit more. Um, we're just waiting on Will, and I'm checking outside um, for a little bit. So, anyways, that's it, and we might be just shooting rather soon. So I'm not gonna waste any battery. So, uh, yeah, we'll shoot. I'll shoot something when Will gets here, I guess.